Cool. Okay, good day. It is Giffadude, aka Jakesu, and uh, now we're casting the last games uh, in the For Fun We Suck at StarCraft tournament. Four players. And the matches will be between Her You Like and Ols is Pro. Seen here, we are randoms and in Zelnaga caverns. With me casting, there are ALI and James. Hey. So we got Terran versus Terran. Should oh be God. interesting. <laughs> Should be interesting. Heard you like so uh, I mean, heard you like said that he's the worst at Terran, and Ols has said that he's the best at Terran. This is going to be mm. interesting. It will. Oh, it will be. I mean, Ols, uh, Ols beat me as a uh, Terran, and he did a pretty good reversal on my Roach push. And uh, I'm interested to see what's happening in this game. I'm getting a bit <laughs> laggy here. They've both started on their Spidey pills. I mean, yeah. yeah. There's nothing much to say. Obviously, they're gonna. Yeah. Supply of, uh, of course, they're going for supply depots. Uh, <laughs> at ten. You know well, what else uh, do you say? Uh, Ols is a bit earlier. Than, Ols uh, is slightly ahead on yeah, mineral like, count. Yeah, two, three seconds. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, in fact, it's, uh, Ols is four seconds ahead. <laughs> See, Ols is on. Ols is four seconds ahead. They're doing. Uh, Mirror match basically here, but I heard you like stop producing SCVs for now, and Ols is going a refinery. He probably Ols knows how to play. Mm. Will he be oh, able and, to get uh, in here? Oh, and heard you like, mm. heard you like put a second barracks up, harassing that probe. I mean SCV right there. Why the hell did he lower that? That just allows him to harass the. Oh right, he pulls an SCV from the line to uh, get the other SCV. But if he's going to and right rat, now, if he's Oles going, isn't, Oles isn't walled orbital, off. So yeah, an orbital command for uh, Oles. Now he's Heard walling he himself off. Scouted his refinery and his orbital command. Yep. And I wonder what I heard you like is going to transfer to from this. Oh, he's making a third barracks. It's a three yeah, racks, uh, three nice racks marine reference. rush. I'm suspecting. I'm suspecting a three mar uh, three racks marine rush here. Yeah, he's making just marines from both of those. He's not taken any uh, gas yet. Oh, he's taking his first, but not taking really any gas yet. I suspect that Ols will be going. And in addition to those marines, I suspect that Ols will be going Destiny Cloudfist. If it's a factory that's going down on the next, uh, Ols has got down his second refinery there. Yeah, so uh, I think Destiny Cloudfish is highly likely. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, uh, he's making a factory. Yeah. Yep. Factory, he's going yeah. for it in Destiny Cloudfish. And heard you like his three barracks up. Isn't producing anything right now. He's just concentrated on moving the Marines. For whatever the hell reason. Yeah. Hmm. It's kind Where of is weird. he going with? And uh, oh. Ols' pro is getting uh, Ols is getting in with a SCV. Is seen, but because uh, heard you like isn't moving with attack move, uh, the SCV slips past. Uh, let's see what Ols does. Tries to scout. He's heard got like down two tech labs and like a reactor. Has two tech labs and a reactor. Actually, this is exactly how I play Terran. It's uh, it's surprising. Uh, I heard you like is playing um, Terran right now, uh, the exact same way I would play Terran, except that he's supply blocked himself. Ols has now just put down his starport. Jesus Christ! And then heard you like has 19 supply, and Ols has almost double. And yeah, Ols's Destiny Cloudfish will probably get this. They're doing okay on their mineral encounter and stuff, but Ols needs to spend some minerals. He needs to get a reactor on that barracks. So he can spend money on marines. Yeah. Oh, Here he could expand. Quick expansion. Hmm. 
Well, it's not technically quick, so it'll be up at, uh, say, eight minutes. Okay, quicker than... Quicker than like. uh, quicker than any other bronze player would do, certainly. <laughs> yes. <laughs> we see Siege Tech for Oles. He likes tanks. And I'm pretty sure that uh, that came out in the first uh, in the first game between me and Oles. I heard you like is just behind on supply now. He's just. I heard you like he's just started researching Stim. Yeah. He's playing Terran exactly how I play. This is scary. Has he been copying my tactics? It'll be interesting to see how much damage this tank can do because he doesn't actually. I heard you like doesn't actually have that many Marines at the moment. Yeah. And Oz is just putting two bunkers and the tank in siege to secure that expansion. Good idea. But he's getting bit high on minerals again. He could double expand if he really wanted to. But he's now too concentrated on putting out the expansion. So he's mm -hmm. letting his minerals slip. Okay, now he's just making two more barracks. That starport isn't doing anything at the moment. Yeah, I think it's just there in case he needs to tech. So yeah. he'll have a production structure ready for it. So if if heard you like goes ban banshees or battle cruisers, <sighs> he could. What's go happening now? Well, we're playing. We are we're playing. Well, we are not playing, but we're casting. What the yeah, hell is happening with the microphone? Oh. <laughs> Sorry, I'm I'm back. Um, yes. <clears throat> yes, yes. And tell um, us who you are. I am Virus. The virus. Or ALI as we know it right now in StarCraft. Yes, right now in StarCraft, where after the holidays I will be called some virus craft. Okay, heard you like tries to do some damage here. Tries to go Those around. Those tanks are whipping him up though. Yep. Those tanks He's do more, way too much damage. Too much damage. Minutes. I'd say already that is. Oh, uh, I wouldn't be saying that just yet, but because Heard You Like is getting uh, Heard You Like is getting tanks of his own now. Oh, Heard You Like's getting a starport too. And uh, Oles is getting Vikings from the starport with no add-ons. All in all, Oz is, uh, Oz is playing this really well. He secured an expansion fairly early, so he'll get a huge income uh, advantage. Yeah, right now, Oz's income is double that of uh, Heard You Likes. BRB! And has a lot more supply count than him. Yeah, definitely. He's moved. He's leaving his army there for the moment, just to keep an eye on that tower, but... Yeah. Oles is leading in both supplies, 41 in worker supply, I heard you like it's 26, and 39 in army supply, and I heard you like it's 30. Now rising up to 31. But, uh, of, course, like of course, Oles' uh, worker supply will be bigger because he has an expansion, and ooh, Oles is moving into I heard you like's expansion now. Uh, he's gonna siege the tanks there. He had that very clever STV there, so they wouldn't expand, and now he's putting in a supply depot. Hmm. Oh god. Yeah, he has the Viking to spot the stuff for the siege tank to shoot. Now he's just gonna run into the meat grinder, like usual. Oh, he has Reapers. Did you like his Reapers? But he's, he's, he's losing like supply so fast that. This might not go well. I mean, Heard You Like does have one siege tank there, but now it starts shooting. He's just going in with those mortars. This There's might actually be bad for all uh, for Olds because uh, oh, Heard You Like doesn't see that tank. This is bad. He just lost a tank for nothing. If he would have uh, scouted the tank with one of those barracks, maybe. Oh, another. Uh, 
yeah, I heard you like Reapers tried to do stuff there, but didn't manage to. And That's the GG. Yep. It was GG when uh, I heard you like put his units into the meat grinder there. Uh, yeah. Oles is uh, expansion, really. And Oles is, wow, 112 supply to 34. That's how you win a uh, TVT, fellas. Anyway. Uh, I think it was quite close all the way through. Yeah. But, oh well. The positioning, yeah, me too. Uh, really, the positioning of Oles' uh, tanks made up for it. I think there's the, the earliness. I mean, not the the way he got his tanks down there in time. If there been any. <laughs> yeah. Well, anyways. Mm. See you in the next games cast, and hopefully it will not be the last because then every sing every single matchup would have been a 2-0, and that would be stupid. Right. Okay, hey there, this is Giverdude, aka Jakesu, and this is the second game of the For Fun tournament of We Suck at Starcraft between Herjulike and Olsus Pro, both playing wow. uh, as random, as that is a condition of the tournament. With me, I have James. Hey. And Ali, who's not actually currently spectating the game. Hey. <laughs> it's viruses, Terran versus Zerg. Oh God, heard you like his Terran again. He's gonna lose. <laughs> <laughs> if what, uh, if what's uh, seen before is true, then heard you like will lose. And Ols is Zerg, like he, just like he wanted. Is Ols good as Zerg? Uh, I don't know if Ols is good as Zerg because I haven't played against Ols when he was a Zerg okay. since. Um, this is actually his first game playing as Zerg uh, that is being casted anywhere, I think. Hmm. So I don't really know what kind of builds he likes, but as heard you like, uh, we know what he likes. He likes three racks and then put, uh, putting his units into a meat grinder. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Right. And that is because he doesn't have proper intel of the enemy's siege tanks. Mm. Well. Just standard, standard old Terran stuff over on Heard You Like's side. Oles is, uh, yeah, he's just droning up. Let's see if he does any. Uh, let's see if he does anything funky with Zerg. Because you can hey, do a I lot of funky stuff with Zerg. Yeah. Like for example, you could go early investors, something like that. No, he's oh. he's gonna do the. Regular throw league thing, which is uh, 30 hatchery. Mm. You uh, usually pros expand expand at 13 hat at 30 supply. So, well, at least he has a build order down. And how do you like his quickly getting down two racks? Yeah. Well, it's typical for him. Also, it's typical for him to place the barracks like that. Yeah. He's probably gonna try the same thing as last game, but as he doesn't know that his opponent is Zerg, this could actually go better or for worse. Because if Herjulike like applies a significant amount of early pressure, he could pro possibly take down this uh, expansion here before Ols has a chance to get roaches has a chance to get roaches, hydras, or even banelings out. Is yeah, because right now he's only got a spawning pool down. He hasn't yeah. even got that. And uh, heard you like scouted the expo. I think he did. Yeah, he saw the expo. So he knows that he has to put early pressure on. At least I think so. Did he see the? Yeah, he um, extractor. Uh, yeah, he did see the extractor. He did see the spawning pool and the expansion. Upgrade yeah, complete. Yeah, so, so he knows everything. He scouts everything. Yeah, he uh, he pretty much knows everything that Ols is doing. Ols is transferring some drones over to the expansion, but uh, he isn't actually making the lava at the expansion into drones, which is peculiar. Okay, now, now, he's, now he's doing that, and uh, about equal on supply. And heard you like is moving out with five marines. Five marines. And yeah. Oh my God. Ols has two queens in production, but he has no zerglings. This could be bad. This could be really mm. bad. 
But it's because it, no, but he's he's oh, getting down. Um, he's spawning more lava, so he can probably get more. Yeah, zerglings when it can, comes down to it. So yeah, he's making six zerglings now. But is six zerglings enough to kill five marines? That's he's got I'm... it on both his bases. Oh no, this isn't. It's not going to have time. Because these zerglings aren't even started yet. He's, he's driven him. He's driving him away though with the. Yeah, he's pulling every uh, drone off, but uh, every single drone of his just died. Oh, we got some zerglings out now. This yeah. means down. Yep. yep, that's nice there. That was good timing. Yeah, although, um, let's see here. Units lost, favors Terran. Zerg lost a lot more. He lost one Overlord, and he's now supply blocked because of that. Not anymore. Zerg lost one and Overlord and damage, uh, damaged his queen to half and also killed all of his mining drones at the expansion. How'd which you like uh, which is actually uh, kind of a lot block. because he had pulled drones off of his main. But right now he's just... Oh, 18 Zerglings and Metabolic Boost. And now having... having He's only just started on his gas. He's got two refineries down now. Yeah. How'd you like but Olds hasn't gotten his second gas yet. He's he has a ridiculous amount of gas right now. He could go for some roaches to spend that gas, or upgrade like upgrade to layer tech and then go roach warren so he can get roaches and the speed upgrade. But he's now just kind of trying to macro it up. Ooh, heard you like his move. Oh. Oh, this is great! The Zerglings can't handle it. Yeah, the Zerglings can't handle it because uh, Heard You Like's Marines were uh, right at the choke. That was awesome. And, and his queen, queen down. goes down. Oh. How many uh, Marines does He's he have there? Supply line he has, now. Does he have like... He has eight Marines there. Oh, if he kills these drones, I think Heard You Like might have a chance of winning. Now his Zerglings are streaming in. But these ones will die. Yes. He's quickly got 14 Zerglings out here, so will that be enough? I don't know. He's I pulled know. off his whole supply line. Yeah. Yeah, these yeah it will be cool. enough, but uh, the damage those Marines caused is tremendous. Oh my god. Zerg has lost 1,775 resources in comparison to Terran's 800. So, uh, major economic damage from that attack. Oh, and Herjilak's just applying crap loads of pressure with this. Now he's making... Uh, he hasn't even made add-ons to his barrack uh, barracks yet. Now he's making add-ons, but now he's, uh, he's just trying to do the same thing again. But is he gonna fall for it? Because this is... This is actually... Uh, 13 oh, Marines now. Oh, how much is that? That's, so that's 17 Marines. He's trying to put down some spine crawlers, but they won't be down in time. Yeah, definitely not in time. Going down. Yeah, I think Herjilak's gonna win with this push. It Looks yeah, Ols right. doesn't have enough. He's he's trying if to Ol uh, make some if Ols uh, if Ols gets uh, those spine uh, if Ols gets even one spine crawler up, it'll help him tremendously. But I don't think he'll uh, manage to do that in time. Broodling, Broodling's second. killing one marine. Always good. Yeah, I, th I think he's able to uh, get those spine crawlers up in time. Yeah, Herjilak won't win with this push. But he can certainly do some terrible damage. Yeah, the spine crawlers are... Spine yeah, crawlers uh, are up. Yeah. These marines, marines were nasty. Oh, but... But that, uh, that was actually really bad, pulling off those drones off of... Uh, the line because uh, the spine crawlers could have handled it without them. Yeah. But now Herjilak has total map control. Oles is, is just uh, Oles is just getting the spine crawlers into a better position and trying to drone up again. Oles is down 200 and uh, 2,100 resources in units lost, so major damage. Herjilak is getting uh, some marauders up. Ooh, Heard You Like is getting tanked. Oh, uh, this will be... Heard You Like is just going for the 
expansion, but... Yeah. Yep, he's making the expansion. Two base Terran against one base Zerg, never good. And I heard you like uh, hasn't been spending his minerals really much. He's two thousand of them now. He could just make and a crap load. Of, he could just make a crap load of barracks and put reactors on all of them and just spam marines. He would. That's what he should do. Because if he, if he did, this base would go down. But he's just he's just letting he's just letting him wait. Yeah, this is kind of stupid actually. But let's see. Oz isn't actually getting any retorts out now, so let's see if he goes roach. Uh, yeah, he's goes going banelings. How'd you like his bringing up his small force of marines and marauders? Yeah, there's one tank in there, well, so seems I'm lagging a bit. Yeah, I'm definitely lagging right now. Oh, or, or it could be someone else too. I know. Yeah, it seems like my computer's lagging, actually. And actually, Owls will have spotted these marines coming along, because he's got the... Okay, now it's a bit better, again. He's got the Zergling by the tower, which has just spotted all these marines coming, so he knows they're coming. Yeah. What will he do? And he's... He has one tank with siege uh, mode available. So this means he'll be able to take down the spine crawlers without any effort. So the baneling nest is now done. But I don't think he'll get banelings in time though. He's making more He's spine not. crawlers, but spine crawlers are really, really futile in those tanks. If those banelings can get a good hit on those marines, look, they're ju uh, they're just crumbling. They're just going. Uh, right next to the tank just to protect it. But here come the bailings and it is a success. Oh, the, the tank didn't die though, so he needs uh, some zerglings in to clear this off. Oh, he's just diving into uh, the spine crawlers. Like I uh, like I said, heard you like really likes to throw his units into the meat grinder. Yeah. He's, uh, he's got 14 zerglings on the way. If he just streamlines these into the tank, he will uh, get it. Yeah, I heard you like is doing three more barracks with uh, two reactors and one tech lab. He's just look at the How resource advantage that he has. He's got six six barracks. Six barracks on two bases. I mean, it uh, it is possible because three racks is supported on one base. He's really being just a bit stupid, yeah. That tank is down. His, his, his army is yeah. his army's gone. His army's gone, but is he gonna try to do a baneling bust on this now? Very is likely. It? But uh, I heard, heard you like likes, pump, likes pumping out marines like no tomorrow. He's got seven. Oh, this is bad. He's queued up all of his barracks. They're full on production. Oh, oh. Wow. Yes. Almost all of his barracks well, are full on production. He has enough. He has, he has enough uh, supply count. No, too. he has seven barracks now. And wow. there out comes a tank there. Yep. Oh, let's see what he's doing. He's got some zerglings up here at the tower, so he got uh, he's got both towers. Uh going for the centrifugal hooks, which is good against this amount of marines that Herjulak's getting. But since he's got his third expansion up. Oh god. His second expansion even. Oh right, uh, Zerg's finally being uh, able to expand now since he's driven the uh, nasty attackers off. And, and heard you like's army has just quickly expanded. He's yeah, he's now a double uh, uh, supply of his opponent. All his zerglings and banelings won't be. I think will be enough. Yeah, uh, and look at this. <laughs> They're going on the opposite sides. Owls should see this, but I heard you like stupid enough to not go and check if he sees the tower. Yeah, he's got a lot of banelings there. He should wait for the centrifugal hooks to finish, though. Or, alternatively, he could just circle around the back. He's got more banelings on the way, oh god. 
Oz doesn't know. <sighs> Heard you like just moving straight into his base. Yeah. Oh, now he, he knows, and he has centrifugal hooks finished. Let's see these banelings tear up this army. Oh, no siege mode! Wow! Whoa! He just cleared out Herjulike's whole army with that. That was uh, that was a really good baneling uh, push. Herjulike's though macroing up really fast. He's got uh, almost the same amount of supply already. But the Herjulike has enough barracks, so his army is now even now it's still is big even though he's just had it exterminated. Yeah, uh, but Oles did manage to secure one expansion here that Herjulike hasn't scouted yet. That's true. What is he? What is he doing there? He's just uh, he's just making a queen there and probably yeah, just droning up. And Herjulike has gone into his second expansion there. Yep. Oh. Uh, Three base Terran against two base Zerg. Three uh, base Zerg? No, his second expansion got taken out. Oh, yes, it did. Uh, uh, he should try to expand to the gold minerals on Herjulike's side because he wouldn't expect that. He expects him to keep on his side because Herjulike's been, so ag ag been so aggressive in this game that he doesn't. Pro he doesn't probably even consider the possibility of uh, Oles having a gold expansion on his side of the map. So we got That's, some banelings yeah, rolling in. Yeah. I don't think that'll be enough banelings for the amount of. Yeah. He has a lot of marines there. Although, if he can run the banelings successfully into the marines, it will do cost effective damage, yeah. But. He's looking for the expansion, actually. I don't know how and he knew. Uh, I don't know how he knew that this uh, was here, but yeah, heard you like lifts off his barracks. I'm um, not barracks, but command center. Stupid. Let's see what oh, he's looking his veins. Uh, ooh, that was nice. Just exploded half of uh, heard you likes. Uh, stuff in there and it even made a even made a refinery go to the red and it burnt down but if you look um heard you like has enough gas he has enough he's lots of they both have lots of yeah. minerals and gas i need to be spending it but. yeah i mean especially heard you like he's going on 1400 plus on both i don't i don't get why he's expanding when he has so much minerals and gas right now already Oles is going for mass creep. Yeah. He's got lots of creep tumors. Lots of creep tumors. Well, he's got his second expansion up now. Let's see if Herjulike's engaging that or the uh, natural. I guess, uh, yeah, he's probably going for the natural again. And lots of banelings. See, if a strategy works once, why not reuse it? Wow, th that is a lot of banelings. 30 banelings. Although this time Herjulike is... Uh, Herjulike is smart these... enough to siege his tanks before going in. These tanks can actually see the his army, but um, they're not doing anything. Uh, then, uh, yeah, because uh, his medevacs didn't spot them. Oh, yeah. oh, and here come the banelings. The tanks aren't in range of this. That's oh my god! Of... Again! I see the same pattern repeating here. Heard you like has his tanks in a uh, in an awkward or bad position, and then he just clears out with uh, banelings. Oh no! But heard you like had uh, half of his army in those medibacks. That was Where's really he, smart. Oh. That the, was the really smart. The line is gone there. He's now taking out his lair. Yeah. I say to GG now. Oles doesn't have anything to defend with, and Herjulike has 106 supply to take the, uh, to take this out with. It's been a really good game for both, though. Having oh, seen uh, having seen so many Baneling uh, bursts just succeed is overwhelming. But let's see. Oles is looking to expand on the opposite uh, main base. 
he probably can't turn this around anymore. And yeah, I heard you like is prepared for him to uh, prolong this game, and he's just making more stuff all the time. He's got some banelings starting down here. Maybe he's gonna try it again. Yeah, but it didn't work last time all that well. I mean, it did work well, but he had uh, most of his stuff in uh, medivacs, so he still had units left after the banelings. Which is I heard you like is massing another army down here. Yeah. The amount of forces he has doesn't look good for old. Yeah. Now the units lost is more in balance, but because Herjulike's been so damn aggressive, he's done more damage to his mineral line. Let's see here. Army supply and worker supply. No contest, really. Army supply is 111 for... Uh, Heard you like and 22 worker supply uh, for heard you like, while 25 workers for uh, Oles and 10 for uh, Oles in army supply. Here come the banelings. I'm lagging very much right now. It's probably Same. because it's probably because I have. Uh, it's most probably uh, just because of my hard drive is gone. Oh. These yeah, these drones are actually managing to take out the oh no, they're not. The marines have yeah, done it. The, uh, the medivacs are too good. And there's the GG from yep. Oz. Well, my wish has come true, so we're seeing a third game here. That was a very interesting game. Yeah, and a long one too. Finally, a game that doesn't last. Uh, 13 minutes and then end. 27 minutes and good macro um, on both sides. Although Oles probably tried the Baneling burst thing a bit too much and heard you like figured uh, to counter it with uh, loading his stuff into medivacs. Yep, good game that and see you in the next match. Hey there, this is Gifferdude, aka Jakensu, and we are taking on the last game of the final uh, matchup in the uh, For Fun We Suck at StarCraft uh, For Fun tournament. That has four players in it. It is Heard You Like uh, StarCraft against Oles is Pro. And the uh, situation is one to one right now, so this match will take it all. And the map is Shakura Splator. We have Olds as Pro spawning as Terran and Heard You Like spawning as Zerg. Oh, this so is go uh, this is going to be interesting. They both are playing the races they know best. Wait, is this the same as the last match or opposite? Uh, no, it's opposite. Uh, it's opposite. Oh. oh. Yes, Heard You Like said he's best at Zerg and Olds has said he's best at Terran. So this is going to be interesting, even more interesting than the last match probably. <sighs> but it it can't really get much more interesting than the last match. God, that was <laughs> epic. From the early pressure to the baneling bursts to the uh, final epic medivac micro. <laughs> I just I just found a way to make that epic. Anyway, pretty standard stuff here. Although I'm interested in seeing what I heard you like's gonna do. Oh, ten pool. Heard you like's going for a ten pool here. While Oles is just making SCVs in the barracks. Scrutus Plotar and Metalopolis are probably the two probably the two most played uh, 1v1 maps right now. Si uh, also, Zelnaga Caverns and Shadow Temple have a really high rating there. Yeah. What? This. Lost Temple was probably the most played before uh, it was removed and replaced with Shadow Temple. Shadow Temple isn't as popular as Lost Temple was. At least that's how I, uh, I've seen it. Okay, well, they've both just scouted each other. Yep. Actually, no, um... Uh, I'll just go for the orbital. Uh, 
and heard you likes. Uh, no, actually, heard you like hasn't scouted. Uh, yeah, I was about yet. to say. And it's not. It's gonna scout his position last. I think. No, he's uh, he's gonna scout his position second to last. Heard you likes getting his queen out. Some more overlords. A good Zerg like Herd you like, well not maybe Herd you like, but uh, a good Zerg will uh, always have more supply than a Terran. Yeah, he's just starting on his second extractor. Yep. And going for a creep highway really early. So instead of the early uh, lava inject, he went for the early creep tumor, which will probably help him more in the long run. I just tend to do the early. Uh, Lava inject because uh, yeah yeah it just can get you a a big supply advantage early on. It's also what you should do if you're going for like early lots of uh, zergling pressure. Oh, Oz is trying to make a bunker here, but it'll fail because Hergelag's putting an expansion there. Oz's bunker Could rush didn't quite that. work. And Oles was already moving his four marines out there, but uh, he. W <laughs> <laughs> oh god! Moves his marines back inside his base. Yeah. And then Oles just cancelled a reactor and put a tech lab yeah, instead. Yeah, tech back up. Tech yeah. Up. And uh, how'd you like expansion time is really good because unlike uh, Oles, who uh, last game expanded really early at 13. Uh, Heard you like has actually some defensive, uh, has some attacking units in here, so he can uh, defend against early pressure. Oles failed there a bit. Yeah. He's. Uh, actually, he's more than a bit. Out, he's, he's pumping out the zerglings at the moment. Yeah, uh, really? and metabolic boost is ready now. So there'll be speedlings. Let's see what he's Oles gonna is. do with that. I think he could be going for layer tech because he has two. Uh, he's got two extractors up. Oles has now got down his factory. Yeah, uh, I'm getting. I heard you like he's getting. Uh, ooh, three overlords and one uh, stack. Okay. Heard you like is just mining way too little minerals like right now. He has two gas fully operational, but no units that take gas. He's on yeah. He's on very low minerals compared to his gas count. Now, what he really should do is upgrade that hatchery into a lair or make a roach warren right about now. He's going for some more creep, actually. Lots more creep. Yeah, and, and what is that? Getting two spine there? crawlers. Spine crawlers. Against their early pressure. It's, uh, of course, early pressure is viable since we've seen. Uh, ooh, Oz is going another Destiny Cloud Fist. Let's see how this works. Oz has actually got two reactors on two of his three barracks, so he's looking to get out lots of marines, obviously. Yeah, two spine crawlers will be really good against those marines, though, because uh, they can just poke once and a marine will die instantly. Yeah. Now, Herjolaik is clearing out the towers. And Herjolaik has a zergling at. Uh, Oles' expansion is probably looking to burrow uh, uh, it once he gets burrow done. Or just to see the timing of the expansion. If he'd burrow it there, it would give a better advantage to him. And Heard You Like is doing exactly what he's always telling me not to do. He's not <laughs> using his energy on his queens. He's not used lava inject for a while on uh, his main. And Heard You Like's just gone for a bathing nest, which is uh, almost complete. Oh god. Oz is going for drops. Yeah, Oz is going for drops. He has one Marauder, six Marines, and eight Marines loaded, and two Medivacs. This'll be really bad for uh, Heard You Like. Although, if Heard You Like will now attack, he can probably bust that easily. Oh, 15 Banelings. Wow. He's looking for the same thing that Oles did last game. Wow, he's really taking the long route. 
<laughs> yeah, wherever this medevac's going. He just gonna take it from corner to corner. And heard you like needs to get something at his base right now, but he doesn't know that Into this is coming. Oh, oh no, he ret heard you like could have seen that with that overlord he has in the corner there, but yeah, he just ran his banelings there, didn't he? Those medevacs are just they're right. They're coming in now. Yeah, heard you like should have uh, should have oh. seen this because uh, he should have seen this. Because he had an overlord there to spot it. He will lose this space. He will lose everything. Heard you like? Go back and make those into banelings. Make them into banelings, good. But I, uh, it's, it's, uh, it's too late. He's already in his uh, base, stimmed up, and just killing all of his drones. And I doubt five banelings can make it. If they can get a good hit on them, I'm sure. Oh no, he's retreated into the Oh, that's just bad. Oles did the same that, thing that to heard you uh, heard you like what well, uh, heard you like did to Oles last game. That it's like a mirror me. match right now. Except it's much shorter. Oh, wow. I can't believe that just happened. It's like uh, they were going exa uh, almost exactly the mirror text Obviously, and yeah. stuff from the last game. Well, <sighs> tournament. Oh. Go uh, hey, it's your fucking medevax. <laughs> <laughs> well, tournament <laughs> goes to uh, tournament goes to Alters Pro with two one. You guys uh, heard you like. And yeah. thanks for watching. See you guys Peace. next time.